This is Scott Nelson, who was facing first-degree murder charges after killing a nanny in Orlando, Florida. So you committed the worst possible crime. Nelson was recently released from a 25-year prison sentence for a bank robbery. After he was let go from his painting job, he decided to plan another robbery. Nelson broke into a house with a knife where a nanny was working as a caregiver. He kidnapped her, threw her in the trunk, and drove to a local ATM so he could withdraw cash. Nelson Nelson then drove to a remote location and stabbed her to death before ditching her body and the car, where he was later arrested. On trial, Nelson argued that the government was to blame. You bought zip ties? Yes, I did. You bought duct tape? That'd be correct. You bought a knife? I sure did. I bought that material because I had a plan in mind of how I was going to survive being thrown on the street again for what, the third or was it the fourth time by the government? And you know, you kick a dog enough times, they tend to bite back and really they just don't care anymore. Nelson continues testifying, showing no emotion and finally admits to the murder. Somebody was going to pay for how you've been treated. That is very accurate. Who killed Jennifer Fulford? I did. He took the stand during the penalty phase and this is what he had to say. How has your mental health been affected by your previous incarceration. I am a homicidal maniac. In the end, Nelson was found guilty of first-degree murder and was sentenced to life in prison.